All right, queens and kings. So for the last portion of the house, I decided to do for the master bedroom and everything in it. So if you guys are new here, you could check out a lot of the other videos to find out full details. But I think I mentioned before, um, anything that's in my house, you probably can check on my Amazon that you see things that um, you may want or something like that. Or I let you know what it is or where I pretty much got it from. I'm not going to do a detail, detail like everything else. Or, yeah. So, start here on the back of the door. This is what we got going on back here. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah girl, I'm pretty like that. Those are my chips for work. But I have these velvet curtains here that I purchased from Amazon. And I think they are 96 inches. Over here, I have my nightstand, which I have one on each side. Um, along on top of the nightstand, I have a candle holder with a jewelry box. Well, jewelry box, a jewelry vase, um, perfume bottle from Z Gallery. The candle holder is from Home Goods, which you also can find some at Z Gallery. The bus is from Amazon. The vase back there is from Amazon as well. And I got some flowers. Now, that canvas is a DIY. Those sconces came from Lowe's, and that mirror there came from Ross which i just about have the same thing on the other side for my husband's side the mirror end tapes came from amazon did i mention that i don't think i mentioned that but the vases down there i just recently purchased those i got those from home goods not home goods hobby lobby and i pretty much had the same thing with the bus but that bus there came from the goodwill i found but the crowns on top of each one of the bus are from amazon that crystal um, is from home goods. I'm not sure where I got that mirror box from, but of course I got another sconce and another one of the DIY canvas that I did. Now our bed is from Amazon. My husband recently purchased for me, um, which is my dream bed. But on the bed here, I have this throw that I got from Amazon. I just have a mirror picture frame that I basically use for a tray or uh, game piece or something. I think I made a while back, but I got one of our family portraits on here. That's me and the kids it was really little. That's when me and Dre really, I think it was our first family photos that we took. Um, it was just some decor, this little flower thing here I made myself. And then I have my favorite Walmart candle, which is this Better Homes and Garden Warm Leather and Amber. Oh my God, it smells so good. Y'all already know how I tell y'all. If it smells like a man, you ain't got now, just get you one of them candles. You'll have one for a moment. Just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. But the comforter is from TJ Maxx. This furry pillar here, that's from Amazon. The two white ones there with the silver is DIY by myself. That, of course, of course. Uh, but the brown pillars are from Amazon. Then those two there came with the comforter. And then I have my sleep pillar where, you know, for to protect my hair and everything. The rug here is from Ross here. This little faux high rug is from Ross. Um, let's see. My dressers here, these are DIYs. I had those for so long. I made them for so long. That's why you see they got cracks and everything on them. But I still love them. I think I'm going to pass them down to my daughter when we do move. Um, I got some more candles up here. Home goods. Now, this here is a DIY of mine. This was actually a pepper salt shaker from Z Gallery. I received some Z Gallery book ends of the diamond ones. They came broken all up, child, and they gave me my money back. So I appreciate that. And I just recreated something else with it, which is these here. Those are DIYs, which are Z Gallery dupes there. Um, this is a actually 55 inch television, a gift from my husband. Um, up here, I just have some wall decor and I just put it in a Dollar Tree tray, nothing special. And of course, I have the fan because we do get hot in here despite that the AC is on. It still get hot in this room. But yeah. Now, over here, I have a floor mirror that I basically got it sitting up on top of some bricks to make it a little bit taller because it did not give me the height. And I didn't want to throw it away and I spray painted it silver. This here is a DIY with this pompous grass, which I totally love it. I totally love it. Um, the candelabra, that is from E Favor Mark yes and behind i have the book ends and another one of the diys and then i just sitting over here is just a bar stool 
a stool. It's a plant stool, actually, that just made into like a, a vanity desk stool. And I just have a brown throw in the extra pillow that came with the comforter. Now for the bathroom. I'm going to turn the light on so you all can see. We basically going to start here. But you guys know I recently did this area here. So I know a lot of you all may be like, okay, why you don't have the shelf? over the toilet i just wanted a different look for you in the bathroom because you always see the floating shelves or any type of shelf over the toilet so this time i just want to do something a little bit different and i actually achieved that and with being mirrors i just got some folk um mirror contact paper put it on there that i got from amazon now these came from what dre Okay, yeah, mother dude never stops. They never stop. That's my shadow. But um, the shelf, the floating shelves, actually from Lowe's. Um, these are very hard to find right now at IKEA. So I did find them at Lowe's. You can find them like in the um, storage location. Um, that aisle there, I don't know which aisle it is. It's aisle nine for me here in Orlando, but yeah you can find them there and i just bought some contact paper like i said and put some contact paper to make a mirror but um these here are some towels here i wanted to go for this look i didn't want the bar over over here i just wanted something a little bit different you know something a little bit different so i just have our some decorative towels pretty much down there you, you can't use those girl. it's just just for, for flash just for flash and then i just made these little diy little um holding hooks i was trying to find some but i was like you know what i'm not spending no more money Cause when I go shopping, I go picking up all types of stuff. So these are actually from the Dollar Tree. You can find in the hardware section. These are push pin for adhesive, not adhesive, up heat for upholstery. That's what it is, child. That's all those is. Um, on top of this shelf here, I just have some canisters that I you see what I have all in it. Then I have this DIY chandelier, um, chandelier. sconce here that I made myself. That is a printable that I print out. Girl, those are holes that I need to patch up. Oh, child. Okay, I'm going to get to it. I'm going to get to it. But anyways, um, yeah, that's all that I have up here. Then I just have some extra bath towel. Y'all know any type of the towels. I done told y'all. Y'all don't go to nobody's house touch their decorative towels. You want to be kicked out real fast? Let's go touch them decorative towels. I'm telling you. Don't even let your side piece know because I, I keep telling y'all. Y'all be laughing at me when I say side piece. I don't know why. Y'all know they out there. They exist. Don't act like you don't know. Don't act like you don't know. But don't let them touch them neither because they good to grab one of these, child. But that, that's in my past. I don't know nothing about that. But <laughs> anyway, some towels up here. Then I have these little soap pumps here. It's supposed to be for um, shampoo and condition. I just never got around to do it. Then I have this little decorative um, candle here that I'm never going to light. The little ball candle. I'm never gonna light it, girl. I found another hole. Now this here, I supposed to be done fixed it. I ain't fixed it, y'all. When I decide I want to move, it's just like everything else just went to the side. So yeah, then some extra toilet paper and this um, bath essential little jar there from Home Goods. They got another one of the decorative pieces. The plant there is from IKEA. Now this is the shower. Ain't nothing special about the shower. Just shower stuff. And I just have this little tower here. It's not a towel, it's a, um, a mat towel, you know, dry for you catch the water because we don't like to step on the rugs. Well, I don't like for the step on the rug because I can't stand a wet rug. I'd rather for you to put a towel down there, even if you don't have this little mat towel thing. Please don't step on the rug. Um, yeah, I know the toilet. Then on top of the toilet, I have this little mirror box that I got from Amazon. Anything from Amazon, you can find in my Amazon store. So here I have a DIY that's pretty much matched the sconces, the sconces, the ones that's on side of the bed. Any DIYs, you can find them in my DIY channel, which is Valerie Glamour's Castle DIYs. Now over here, ooh, child, let me turn the exfoliation down. It's so bright, ooh, child, but it's so beautiful. Look at that. Um, but up here, yeah, I see. Yeah, I know I live in an apartment, so I did this little friendly apartment hack here because I have seen some um, ceiling chandeliers or something like that, and I always wanted to try it, and I got around to really do it. I like the outcome of it. I, I want to put some more up here, but it's, it's not going to happen. Not right now. But anyways, coming down, I have this vase here. This one here came from 
One came from Amazon, because Amazon sell these too. Not only just Z Gallery, Amazon sell them too. But I have some flowers in there. And then coming down, I have this little tray here, just some extra. The towels, now don't, don't let your guests use your towel. I have, my husband, no, not to touch it. Dre, Dre don't want to see me get mad. Dre don't want to see me getting mad, so he don't touch that. But I got some pumps here. This one is supposed to have lotion in it. Of course, you got to have some hand sanitizer. And then this is some soap, foam soap for bath and body works, of course. And then another one of those candles. This one, I first got introduced to this candle from Walmart. And I love it. So coming down here is just some more decorative towels. And then we got the scale over there, the trash can. And then some more toilet paper holder over there. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the bathroom. Nothing going on else. Let's move on to the closet. So here I just have some canvas, some picture frames that never did got no pictures in them or a DIY done on them. Now for the closet, of course we had to put a little crystal knob there. The closet is still pretty much the same. Ain't nothing pretty much changing. Dre just doesn't put too much on his shoes in there. Most of them is in his man cave. But yeah, so this is his side still. This little furry rug here is from Amazon. When I first got it, I didn't like because it was like, um, I don't know, something about the shade of it. Now, see how the, the shade that you all see now here on camera, that's the shade that it looked like when it arrived. But now I'm standing in person, it's actually darker like the pillars on the bed. I still have these over here. You see I lost another knob. I recently just found out that I lost that, so that means Andre pulled on it. Um, my purses and stuff still up here. My crystals and stuff. Some bling jewelry. Makeup brushes and stuff. Um, perfume. Um, I had one of you queens to ask me to do a perfume collection haul. I can do that. I can do that. If you guys want me to do it like up in a vlog or something. But I don't think I'll do like one video dedicated to it. I don't know. We just have to see. But um, up top here. I just have, I like to collect the perfume bottles. I have those up there with Roses Forever, um, Chanel boxes and stuff. That is a DIY. I just need to put some batteries in there so it can work. My shoes up there along with the big bags that I do have. Um, my clothes and everything here. So, yeah. Shoes down here also, which I'm starting to collect stuff there. That's just the box that my Teddy Blake um, bag came in. An extra one of my favorite candles. Some extra pair of shoes and a ring light there that I need to go ahead and use. Now over here, I have some mirrors, which I did have this as looking like a um, floor mirror type thing. But by we put these dressers in here to give us some extra space for the storage clothes. I really do like it because it didn't take away from that because, you know, I got the extra... Uh, mirror over there so it really take away so we have some old ikea dressers here that you can see all beat all up but they still do the job um on top of here i have my jewelry tray then i have a diy tray that i did a while back then a brown vase um another one of those down this one here is z gallery so that one is z gallery and the big one that's in the bath on the z gallery but the one over there by my bed the vase that one is from Amazon, the medium size one. So, yeah. Then I have another candle over here and then a body shape candle. But above there, you see that I have a DIY as another one of those little, um, you know, a lot of people don't like the little modern look, but they have more of a light fixture or something over it. They keep finding from Amazon. So that's basically the look that I was going for. And the, those lights doesn't work neither. But I also have like a washer tape design going on this wall here which i still do love it i think it's going to be in the next apartment too but yeah so that is the closet that is the closet that is the room that is everything everything y'all look at it i ain't shame but yeah so that's everything